Hey. Hey. My name is Luigi. Get it right. Hello, everyone. I'm the game here. Welcome back to more Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. I don't know why I talked to this guy in the middle of my intro. Uh. Huh? What? what? Hey, who did this? Who put the cargo in this area? How are we supposed to get to the deck that, with this in the way? I don't know. Welcome back to Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. In the last episode, we began our trip to the Bean Bean Kingdom in order to go searching for P Princess Peach's voice. In this episode, we're going to head up to the deck and go talk with Bowser so we can begin the Bean Bean immigration. But first, let's hit this block. Oh, that looks, oh, that looks cool. Oh, it's going to move the cargo. Per uh. <laughs> and Luigi is dead. Well, that was a short... Well, let's just axe that part off the title. Oh, looks like the crane mistook your, you for cargo. That looks uncomfortable. Hey, since you're up there, why don't we use you as a lookout? Okay, but how are we supposed to get past the cargo? I guess we just did. <laughs> well, I guess he's doing a, he's doing a great job being a lookout. Your rancidness. Luigi's just kind of going along with everything today, really. We'll soon pass over the border between the Mushroom and Bean Bean Kingdoms. <laughs> nice work. You can go back below decks now. Eh, what's all the hoopla? Hoopla! I dropped my phone that had my timer. Ah, what now? What now is I really need to grab some water after this. All these voices are doing hell to my or hell from Earth. <laughs> Who would have thought that you'd catch up to the great Cacoletta in even a hundred million years? You, you're the fiend. Oh, you, you're the fiend who stole Preacher's voice. How dare you pull off such a cool evil plan? That was my Tuesday plan. I'm now going straight back to the Bean Bean Kingdom so my next plan can take root. I have no time to chat with the likes of you. Faffle, take care of this. Grr, hold it! <laughs> I am the great Cacoletta's most best, most best pupil, who is named Faffle. I am here, laughing at you. you. If you are giving us the chase just to get your silly princess's voice back, voice, then you are idiots of foolishness. Princess Peach's sweet voice will soon be the bled that makes the sandwich of Cacoletta's desires. Okay. And this battle shall be the d delicious mustard in that bled, the mustard of your doom. But I like mustard. Oh, that's not good mustard. It's Dijon. Ta-ha! <laughs> I snuck up behind you. Next it is the turn of you. Time for our first boss fight against Fawful. Hit him. <laughs> That's really all I can say. There's not much strategy in some of these early fights. Finklat. As you can see, his te depending on uh, when he attacks, he will say a phrase, and that attack basically determines who he's going to attack. It's not that complicated, but it's but it uh, just just keep in mind that he uh, just keep it in mind. God. Sometimes I get upset with my own speech. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna go over here. You guys got this. Hey, want to dodge his nuts attacks? Uh, I mean, I kind of already did, so it's... Sure, whatever. Before he attacks, watch what he says really carefully. Such mumbling. Stop it! Think that! When the stuff is nuts that is red. He's attacking you, Mario. All enemies have a hint in their attacks. So keep your eyes on them. Finklat! Hey, you get to attack twice. That's not fair. I mean, technically there's two of us. But, like, he as one person gets to attack twice. Have you readiness for this? He's now going to... When, he's, when he gives those super long phrases, he'll set in two attacks. One at, Mar one at Mario, if it's red. And then the, the other at the other bro. So just keep in mind what the color is, and then just keep in mind that you're going to have to jump with the bro right after. So for example, this time he's going to attack Luigi first, and then Mario. Not that hard. Ozzy, it's a really easy first boss fight. He's already down. And we can just keep pummeling him. Now is when I ram you. And if you uh, are ready for him, you can now counterattack him. He's really not that tough, but he is a first he is our first technical boss fight, so don't expect too much. 
His attacks are really predictable, and he alone isn't that strong. That's why I honestly didn't give him good bio form. Yes! Yeah. How could think rats like you beat such an awful nasty as me? Headgear! I have fury! Yeah, now is when the talking stops. I do not have time to stop and smell foul roses such as you. One fell swoop is the way I will deal with you, fink rats. What is a fink rat? Oh, he laughed so hard it made me burp. I'm sorry, excuse me. He last Look, look, my gas is spewing off the ship. Oh, okay. Chimel Starshade, a massive explosion has been sighted. Confirmation, ID confirmation. Chimel Starshade, meteorites confirmed. Impact in Stardust Fields, initiate recon. Emergency, emergency. The Beam Beam Borderland. Duh, duh, my face. Wait, no, there they go. <laughs> the physical comedy of these two is uh, outstanding. Alright, let's get going. So here we are in Stardust Fields, in the wreckage of, uh, in the wreckage of a Bowser ship. And luckily there's a safe block right here, so don't worry too much. Let me just save this real quick. Just write down, calm, peaceful. Put that whiteout on. Our third layer of whiteout, I believe. All right, cool. All right, back to things. Oh, this guy doesn't look too good. He looks like he's gonna be a dry bone soon. Cooper Cruiser. Yeah, I'm finished paying it off. Ooh, that's a rough one. Find Lord Bowser. Yeah, help us. Bowser fell on the other side. Ah oh, man, he crossed without us. What a jerk. Guess we gotta go after him. Hey guys. Well, well, talk about a nice surprise. Check it out, bro. Looks like the famous Mario Bros have arrived. Man, this really brings back the memories, doesn't it? Good times, good times. Look, they even have a Mario poster on the wall. Hey, uh, so what's up, brothers M? Are you two and off on a drink together? Oh, so you probably want to let us to let you pass, huh? Yeah, well, I'm sure you guys know this is the border of the Mushroom Kingdom. That's right, it's the border. Since we're the border security, we can't let you in. Until you do some jumping worthy of the Mario name. I feel like you're supposed to just look at our passports, but you're doing this because it's fun. Is this one of those, uh, is what they have you do in the, uh, what's, what's it called at the TSA? The, uh, extra screening? They just make you jump? Want to do the border jump? Well, let's explain it so we know. The rules are really simple. Just jump to avoid touching the royal borderline. And keep on jumping until that flag in the background reaches the top of the flagpole. But listen, if you're the one who makes three mistakes, then the game's over. The end. What's that, bro, 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 bro? Anyway, we'll be nice and let you practice first. Sound good? Oh, Luigi already jumped the border. Alright, Mario, you go first. Press the A button jump. Okay. Next is your turn, Luigi. Press the B button jump. Yep, so it's time to initiate in the border jump. And I'm not kidding, that's what it's called. Okay, Mario, try to jump the rope. Or, I mean, try to jump the royal borderline. That's right, you have to jump the border to get into the BB Kingdom. Yeah, that was incredible! Now it's your turn, Luigi. Let's see jump. Man, that was incredible! Alright, Mario. No, and you too, Luigi. Let's try it together. Not much to say here. It's, a, it's just jumping the border. Man, that was incredible. Well, that's all the practice you get. Wanna do the boil jump? Yeah, we're good. I don't Alright. Hey, Luigi jumped the border. He did it. Start level one. So level one's not that hard. Basically, each bro has three lives. Don't get hit three times. And as long as both brothers don't get... Neither of the brothers don't get hit three times. You're fine. Oops. See? I'm at... So... They will try to trick you in some instances, like there. Man, very cool. That was some incredible jumping. Clear. 
Oh man, we've got the fireworks. We did so well. Just beyond here is the Beaming Kingdom. Be extra careful when traveling here. <clears throat> well, that was great. I want to jump the border again. You ready to try the infamous Border Jump 2 challenge? Yes. Let's do this. So come back in here lets you do the Border Jump again. But this time, harder. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Luckily, there's not much penalty for jumping extra. Okay. Except in that case. Mario can't get hit again like that. Game over. You guys want to try again? Yep. I'll admit, I did badly there. Stop doing the fake outs. What kind of border patrol is this? What kind of border patrol fakes out people? You can see, you can see I'm a little over cautious now because I don't want to me mess up twice. Oh, that was it. They were doing a wiggle. I was like getting ready. Man, man, very cool. That was some incredible jumping. For clearing this again, not only do you get a thousand points, very important, you also get a bit of a little extra here. You've cleared level two. That was some great jumping. How about being your award commemorated? You can't find a side of being it just anywhere. All yours. Enjoy. You get two he beans. Well, that was so fun. Let's do it again. You ready to take the super board jump challenge? Yep. Time for level three. You can honestly memorize all of these. Oh, crap. So as you can see, these only get harder, and I did not do well there. And I can, but it's okay, I can only get worse. See? I told you I can only get worse. Why did I not jump with Luigi there? Wow, I, I'll get this, I swear. I'm good at this game, I promise. See, I'm already learning. I mean, I made it further, so that's good. Okay, okay. I don't think the border is supposed to work like this. Okay, 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 slow down, please, please, please. Okay. That was uh, a bit too fast for me. There's only so many buttons here, guys. Ah, crap. I still messed it up. Oh, crap. I just can't mess up again. That's all. I can't mess up again with Luigi. It's fine. It's fine. I won't. I just won't. Simple. Simple as that. We might need a fail montage here. Assuming this keeps going. I'm assuming it won't. I'm hoping it won't. Please don't let it. Wow. Did I seriously just do... I think this is going swimmingly. I wasn't re I'm not ready for the spin cycle. Did they do it? Oh, right as I said I need the fail montage. Clear. Only 500 points for that. The last one was 1,000. I guess it's based on how many lives you have left. But luckily, uh, the points don't matter. What matters is the amount of heat beans you get. So by completing level 3, you of course get 3 heat beans. Those are some nice beans. Alright, one more time. Do you want to play Super Bowl Jump Sunshine? Gee, I wonder what was coming out at the time. I'm also going to assume that Luigi's Mansion is out considering they're referencing Mario Sunshine and that came out after Luigi's Mansion. 
Yep, now it gets even harder. Now they crisscross. Wow, muscle memory kind of is setting in with this. Okay, they're going a, a little bit. Hey, okay. Yes, please. I was not ready for the crisscross. I'm more ready for it this time. See, I'm more ready for it. Haha. -ha. You won't trick me with your fancy clock. Okay, they got me. Oh, is that it? Oh, wow. That one actually was really easier for me than the last one. We even got a whole 2,000 points and a lot of fireworks. And with that, we get a lovely award. See, you know how it goes. We, we got uh, level 2 gave us 2 he beans. Level 3 gave us 3 he beans. So it only makes sense that this one gives us 5. Look, I get it. It's the hardest level. But, uh, still... And just to demonstrate, if you go back in one last time, that was the last level, thankfully. If you want to play, you can now pick whichever level you want. Be it the first one, the second one, the Super Bowl Jump, or the Sun Bowl Jump Sunshine. But we don't need to take it, any of this. Unless you want to do the complete Border Jump Challenge. With three lives, you have to complete all of the Border Jumps. I'm going to regret this. Luckily, the flag still does tell you. And I already messed up. We're off to a great start. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. It's okay. We're still doing alright. Okay, I forgot that they did that. Alright, we might lose this. How... I'm debating how much I care about all this. Okay, game over. Yeah, let's see if we can do it. Maybe I should just give up now. Wow, I'm doing all I'm doing worse than last time. I keep falling for that. Well, I can do this without getting hit one more time. See? I just have to be, I just have to play the best Mario of my life. Jump, jump better than I ever have before. See? I can do this. I don't need this. Ah, damn, I jumped too soon. Alright, I'm ready this time. I'm not ready this time. <laughs> okay, hang on. I will get this, don't worry. I won't be here for hours. I hope. Come on. You guys are cool, just... Oops, I fell for it again. Fall for that every time. Oh crap. It's okay. It's only one. Have we even made it to the sec to the third one yet? Oh, I didn't realize they were gonna bring it all the way across. Damn it! <sighs> it's so much to memorize. I can get it, I swear. I just have to be better. I have to I have to summon my inner Mario. <laughs> I got so I gotta be like uh I gotta be like Chris Pat, summon my inner Mario. I am now Mario. <laughs> this is my Mario voice. It's unlike anything you've ever heard. God that was so 
Can you, you can tell that this when this was recorded after, just based on that joke. I can get this. I swear. I don't even know what the reward. I don't remember what the reward for this is, but I want it badly. It will bug me if I don't get it. This is an endurance test. This is a test of skill, even though it is. It's a test of endurance. Can I outlast them? The answer is yes. I will jump across this border that I've already jumped across and technically I'm allowed to continue the game. But this is for a matter of pride. I've already done all of this, but I, w I, I have to do it better. I'm doing better. I'm learning, adapting, evolving. I'm evolving into the best Mario I can be. I actually have a Mario hat somewhere in this house. I just don't know where it is. I don't want to go looking for it right now. It's okay. I just won't get hit. And that's it. That's all you have to say. It's just I won't get hit. As long as you just tell yourself you won't get hit, you won't get hit. That's all it takes. That's how you win fights. Don't, don't take this advice for actual fights. I won't point that out. You guys, don't you guys have anything more important to do? I mean, you guys said you were going on some pretty big adventure, right? Don't you guys want to go do anything else? Literally anything else? I mean, you got things to do too, you know? You have paperwork to fill out. This is our job, you know. How long can we spend on this one segment? I have, I have, I have places to do, things to be. I can't lie and say I'm not having fun, though. This is a fun mini game. I just wish I was better at it. You know, technicality, I can cheat because I am playing this on the Wii U. And just be like, oh yeah, I'll just like save state at the end of each one so that way I can do that. But that's not fair. That's not why I picked the Wii U. I picked the Wii U because I don't, uh, because I don't have a way to record this on Game Boy. So we're playing this on the Wii U. It's not necessarily the definitive version, but it is in fact a version. Then the definitive version is on the 3DS. That's something I haven't talked about yet. But we're not going to talk about that now. We'll talk about that later today. Talk about when I'm not doing this. Does, everyone, does every person who comes here have to go through this border screen process? I feel like this is a bit obsessive. Oh, right. That's the super fast part. Come on. I got this. I got this. This will not turn into an hour-long recording session. This 34 minute. Okay, maybe I should take a break. I'll come back to this, I swear. Alright. What actually, hang on. I'm actually gonna check. What is the reward? You'll have to try again. What is the reward for this? I actually forgot. So, I couldn't do it. I tried for, I'd say, a good 20 minutes? To put it simply, the complete board jump challenge gives you seven he beans. It's not overly worth it, but it is somewhat worth it. Hold up, bros. We kind of kicked your ass back there for like 30 minutes, so we're just going to go ahead and, uh... I mean, we got to commemorate this by giving you this. We feel kind of bad. As long as you have this map, you'll feel safe in four lands, right? Press left to view the, the menu screen and check out that map. Alright. Hey, look, a pipe. We're used to these. Fascinating. Just keep in mind this pipe is here because it will come in handy. Anyway, let's go ahead and check this. Bean Bean Bulletin Board. Disturbing facts uncovered in Area 64. Get it? Uh, recent studies show that the Spiky Stars Defense System, SSDS, can be jumped. This is easy to uh, just run, press A, then immediately press the B button. This defense gap is appalling. Improvements are demanded to prevent increasing intruders. I like how they not only tell us that, they, that there's a flaw in the defense system, but exactly how to get past it. What a great, what a great military the Bean Bean Kingdom has. Mushrooms. We're actually able to explore Star's Fields and meet our first new enemy, the Fighter Fly. And this is when I'm going to start changing things up. There are a lot of enemies in this game. and. I can't go over stats for every one of them. Hell, I haven't even been going over the stats for the ones we fought so far. So whenever we encounter a new enemy, we're going to put their passport on screen. So we're just going to take a nice little sh passport photo. And now you'll be able to see the major stats, their HP, power, and defense on screen for you to look at. And now we can properly kill them. 
Also, if there's anything else of note, uh, I'll be sure to put we'll be sure to put it in there too. But for right now, let's just kill these fighter flies. Easy as pie. I think pie isn't that easy. Have you ever tried to make a pie? I have. I'm bad at baking though. All right, back to the murder. And once you, like I said, once you get an idea of how they move, you can't get an idea of how easy it is to not only hit them, but to counterattack them. Um, I can't get up there. I don't think I can do anything over here yet, so we're going to ignore that. Oh yeah, save block. We can save all my failed attempts. We're going to watch that timer jump up. Let's go ahead and just see how long I spent there. Oh, that's painful. <laughs> Let's just climb these stairs and forget that ever happened. Okay, okay. Hey, Bowser. Oh, sweet. We robbed them. Hey, why do I feel three coins poorer? Hey, Mario. Great timing. Use hand here. Kind of stuck. Look, keep your diet jokes to yourself. They're not funny. Just get me out of here. Nicky <laughs> Dick. Why could it be that Bowser, the great Cooper King, has fallen into my cannon? Nick, how amusing. Who dares speak to me so? Nick, Nick, Nick. I am Toolstar, the great and famed King of Stardust Fields. I've heard tales of you, but you aren't very impressive in person. Nick, Nick, Nick. Nick, Nick, if you want me to get him out of there, little people, you must pay him coins. I'll set him free for all of your coins and keep his most embarrassing incident secret. What? That's not fair. Pardon me? I'm not sure I heard you correctly just now. You, uh, you, you'll give me all 119 of your coins? Yeah, sure. I mean, we kind of need him. He's helping us. I mean, we're, it's not that hard to get coins. I mean, we got an extra 19 just on our way here. Nick, Nick, Nick. Why, these are Mushroom Kingdom coins, aren't they? I mean, yeah, we're from the Mushroom Kingdom. This is the Bean Bean Kingdom. I suppose I have to calculate the value in the local currency. Let's see, at today's exchange rate, 119 mushroom coins are worth 10 bean bean coins. Proof that mushroom king that the mushroom kingdom's currency is absolutely worth it. Worthless. I'm sorry, but for only 10 coins, I can't guarantee the secret won't slip out. Nyak nyak. Yes, that means I'll need an additional 100 bean bean coins. You'll find them in Stardust Fans and bring them back to me. Then I'll help you, Koopa King. The Grand Stars Fields and find me 100 coins. You can find them in blocks or win them in battles. Check your menu and uh, see how many you have. Uh, guess time for a part of RPGs no one likes. Grinding! I'm technically not wrong. This is a grinding set. Ow. Doesn't that damage me too? I think it did. Because I'm pretty sure Mario had 11 HP after that last battle. Alright. There's a fighter fly over there. I totally walked past it and I didn't realize. Alright, let's kill the fighter flies. Oh, lucky. That's something we can talk about. It's a critical. You get lucky. That's it. Alright, moving on. Oh, well, we already got five coins. That's something. Alright, let's make sure we're lined up. I always want to do this when you see a block like this. Ah, oh, crap. Sometimes I press the button. You can hear it click, but it doesn't click. You know how it goes. Let's give it twenty. Um. Ooh. Sometimes it's about, it's not about speed, it's about rhythm. If you know what I mean. Like, if you, like, you can, like, hit the button really fast, but if you don't have the rhythm right, right sometimes you won't jump. And that's the problem with stuff like this. Man, these fighter flies are real aggressive. Just look at them. They're coming right at me. I'm really sarcastic. I really should reduce my sarcasm a lot. I feel like I'm overly sarcastic at points. Alright, let's put it... Uh, let's put it into your defense. You've been getting hit a lot more than Luigi has. Oh man, that one point gonna go far. To be fair, the only reason you'd be getting hit more than Luigi has is because I'm bad. Boing. I said boing. When I say boing, you go die. Oh, a new enemy. Go ahead and put a fastball on screen. 
So I'm going to say right now, counterattacking these, I don't think does much. You can do it, though. These guys are pretty tough, though. They have high defense, but not a lot of HP. Let me see. Yeah, counterattacking them does nothing. They'll only attack the bro directly in front of them, so don't be too concerned. They're not that tough. Anyway, that's it for the Bill Blasters. Uh, uh, something I just realized I did not say their name for. Um, I'll put, I'm going to put Luigi in the speed because he's been moving pretty slow. When I was a kid, I used to just go down the line. I realized you should really put it towards a variety of stats. Sometimes it's just you have, you have decent stats in some categories and bad stats in others. You really should just try to boost where your stats are bad. In general. Alright. Uh, we're about to learn a new mechanic. Bike pads. Hold the control pad left to right uh, to that direction, then press A, B, A, B, A, B. Let's go ahead and try them out. They're basically like bicycle pedals, and that's it. Alright. Gotta get the rhythm right. Alright, how many coins have we made so far? Wow, we're already at 51. We are over halfway there. That didn't take that long at all. Uh, let's jump down here. Let's trap ourselves. Some syrup. We'll talk about what syrup does later. Uh, we can't progress forward. So I feel it's area 64. Well, seeing as we can't... Oh, there's an area down here. Let's go check out down here first. Just because I can. You technically need to head up there, but... Ah, hey, a safe block. I mean, all actually with the save lock here, I'm totally okay with ending this episode, but I, I'm debating if I will. Boink. Yeah, you can just dodge these because, again, the counterattack doesn't matter. I'll take these guys out. Or not. That's fine, too. I wish the counterattack launched it back. I thought that would be nicer. Alright. Um... Is there anything else around here I want to do real quick before... Because I'm thinking I might end the episode off here. There's, I spent a lot of time at the board jump, so my timer means absolutely nothing anymore! It's never a good sign when your timer doesn't mean anything. I'm accidentally counterattacking these. I'm not trying to. Sometimes you're just too good for your own good. I think that might be it. Mostly because we can't do anything over here anyways. After I kill this fighter fly. He gets to die. Eventually I'm going to start cutting these fights out. Probably next episode because there's going to be a lot. And I usually uh, go do every fight for experience because, well, experience is a good thing. Boink. It honestly is pretty helpful to just do every fight for experience. It can get a little tedious, but it also means you get good at fighting these and you're le taking less damage by doing so. Alright, cool. Well, ending on uh, a good old 66, I think we can call it this episode. Mostly because we spent so long, and honestly, by the time we got to Tollstar, I had completely lost track of how long this episode was. I didn't stop my timer, and I really wish I did when we got to the fail montage part. Off screen... I might try the border jump again. Maybe if I get it, I'll show it, but I don't know. I think for now, that's going to be it for this episode. Next time on Mario Luigi Superstar Saga, we're going to continue looking for coins for Tollstar. And maybe, just maybe, check out what's over here. Over here at Area 64. See you guys then. Oh, laters! I'm also just going to do a bonus save for myself. It doesn't hurt. Look, that's the main. Look, that's the benefit of playing on the Wii U. I'm gonna use it when I do, when it's just like I already like. Sometimes I just want in the episode and you go to pick up right where I left off. Okay, okay. See you guys later.